the other fundamental, the core component of a healthy society. We cannot talk about da'wah. We cannot talk about establishing a harmonious Islamic society until we have a har harmony inside the household. But our households are the places of chaos. How are we talking about higher ideals in da'wah when our homes are broken? Husband and wife are arguing every day. Sarcasm inside the house. Nasty commentary towards each other. You know, you're really not that pretty. Oh, you don't know Yusuf alayhi salam yourself. You don't see me cutting my hands. <laughs> no. Unnecessary sarcasm. Unnecessary co hurtful commentary towards each other. Hurtful words to it. And you know, a lot of times you know exactly what's going to annoy your wife. And you do it anyway. And a lot of times the women, they know exactly what's going to get under his skin. And they'll say it anyway. Just to see what happens. Right? And who's watching all of this? While you're doing this to each other. These word games you're playing with each other. And this battle inside the house. Who's watching? Who's the real victim? The children. The children are learning this behavior. What kind of parents are they going to be when they grow up? There's no sense of forgiveness inside the marriage. You know, the, the Muslim man, a lot of you who work in, you know, in the public sphere, or in corporate or whatever else, you'll go to work, your secretary, highly inappropriately dressed, is smiling at you. How's it going, Muhammad? How's your day? And like, it was pretty good, yeah, I had, you know. And you're having like five minute conversation with the secretary. You come home, the wife says, how was your day? I don't want to talk about it, I had a long day at work. This is what we're doing inside our homes. Ruining our own relationships with our spouses. When was the last time, let me tell, ask the brothers, I'm not in a position to speak on behalf of the sisters because I'm not one. They should be getting advice from sisters. But let me talk, about, I'll get on your case for a minute. On my own. When was the last time you got her a gift, man? When was the last, you took her out to the, to the bazaar over there and she picked something, like, no, 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 put that back, put that back. When was the last time you got her something? Spont without her asking. When was the last time you hung out with her? Just took her out for some ice cream for no reason. For much, they also just ask for your time. They only ask for your time. Wallahi, there are sisters who complain to me, and I couldn't believe my ears. They complain to me that they haven't seen their husbands forever because when they come home, they sit on the computer and just YouTube away the whole night. And they haven't seen, they're crying. It's like we're not even married anymore. Get off the computer, man. You have a wife, you have children to deal with. That's your priority. سبحان الله والحمد لله ولا إله إلا الله سبحان الله والحمد لله ولا إله إلا الله سبحان الله والحمد لله ولا إله إلا الله